हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू वन मोर न्यू वीडियो ऑफ लर्न इट एंड विदाउट वेस्टिंग मोर ऑफ योर टाइम लेट गेट स्टार्टेड टुडे विल बी टेकिंग टॉपिक फोर ऑफ स्पोर्ट्स एंड न्यूट्रिशन द फर्स्ट टॉपिक इन दिस वीडियो विल बी अबाउट स्पोर्ट्स न्यूट्रिशन नाउ व्हाट इज द स्पोर्ट्स न्यूट्रिशन इट इज बेसिकली दिस study and practice of nutrition that deals with the nutritional requirement of a sports person a sports nutrition plays important role to attain different excellence in sports the appropriate proportions of vitamins minerals carbohydrates fats proteins and fibers are very essential for the proper nutrition of the sports person as a result of the higher amount of physical activities in sports athletes require more nutrients to keep the energy level adequate during a sports training session an athlete tends to lose a lot of fluid and electrolytes fluid loss negatively affects the sports person of an athlete if not replaced in time thus it is very vital to drink enough water and electrolytes after a training session Now, what are the effects of diet on the performances of an athlete or an sports person? A proper diet is intake of appropriate types and adequate amount of food and drinks to supply nutrition energy for the maintenance of the body cell, tissues, and organs to support the normal growth and development of an body. And when we are talking about the sports person, it will affect the sports person in this case. so for an sports person or an athlete it is very essential to take a balanced diet as lot of physical activity and endurance is required in the sports so the quality of the sports person or the sports will depend on the diet of that sports person so for the sports diet depends on the correct proportions of different products which is carbohydrates fats proteins minerals and salt etc which constituent the main nutrients of the diet now let us move to the factors affecting the diet so there are several factors which will affect our diet the first is the age sex and body surface area so when we are talking about the age to age from a different age to a different age the youngster need different types of food both in quality as well as in quantity and when we are comparing it to the older ones they will need less quantity and with lesser fat due to the body composition of the different ages it also depends from male to female also the male consumption of the food is more as is compared to the female next is types and duration of the activity now diet also depends on type of activities that we are doing if we are doing exercise will require more amount of diet or more amount of food than if we are not doing anything and just sitting the next is eating habits and social customs eating habit and social custom also affect the diet of an individual which means how they are eating if they are watching the tv or if they are not watching the tv if they are working and eating if they are watching and eating or if they are around some people who are also eating then it will depend on that circumstances of your environment the next is known as the climatic factors now various foods in different climates which means food varies in different different climates like the diet is different in summer as we are com- we compare it to the winters we take different kind of food in summer and we have a little bit change in winter season so this is also a factor which affect the diet the last is the health status and growth if you are in a good state of health then you will have a good diet whereas if you are in a health and healthy state or an individual is unhealthy he cannot have a similar kind of diet his diet will be less so now let let us discuss about the pre during and post competition fluid and meal intake taken by the sports person the first we will be talking about is the pre competition meal now what is the goal proper to the competition or a training session is to maximize the carbohydrate stored in the muscles and the livers and to top up blood glucose stores now why does we take the pre competition meal is to help in sustaining the energy to boosting the energy or to boosting the performances hydrating our body with the water preserving our muscle mass so that we don't lose it and the last thing is to recover speedingly after the competition so that we can get ready for the next competition 
सो देर आर सम ऑफ द पॉइंट्स टू बी रिमेंबर्ड और द पॉइंट्स आर अंडर न्यूट्रिशनल रिक्वायरमेंट ड्यूरिंग द कॉम्पिटिशन वॉट एवर यू ईट और ड्रिंक ड्यूरिंग अ कॉम्पिटिशन और अ ट्रेनिंग सेशन इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट अंडर डिफरेंट टाइम ऑफ सर्कमस्टेंसेज और अंडर स्पेसिफिक सर्कमस्टेंसेज फॉर एग्जाम्पल लाइट मील्स आर रिकमेंडेड एंड कार्बोहाइड्रेट शुड बी कंज्यूम्ड इन जेल फॉर्म्स सो दैट नो डाइजेशन वर्क हैज टू बी डन ऑन दैट फूड स्पोर्ट्स ड्रिंक मे बी यूजफुल सिंस दे हैव इलेक्ट्रोलाइट्स दैट कैन हेल्प टू स्पीड हाइड्रेशन एंड रिकवरी The next is many endurance athletes prefer to drink water and eat different kinds of food and other food to supply their energy even on really long runs. If you are exercising intensively for longer than two hours, especially in the heat heat time, do not rely only on the water alone. This will decrease your performance and your recovery speed also. So always use commercially carbohydrate drinks 15 to 20 minutes before the start of the competition and not at the time of the competition. Now let us talk about the post competition meal which we will take after the competition has been over. So some of the helping nature of this post competition meals are it helps in the recovery of the sports person it also helps in rehydrating of the body refueling the body with the energy building the muscles and to improve the future performances so these kind of sports post competition meal has to be taken and these are some of the points which has to be kept in mind now let us talk about the food supplements for the children's now what is food supplement is these are the dietary supplements which are nutrients that are added to your diet which is in extra amount like if you are having protein powder that is called a food supplement if you are taking certain kinds of vitamins minerals herbs amino acid or enzymes and other beneficiary substances in forms of some some capsules or in some form of some tablets then it will be called as a food supplements next if you are taking balanced diet regularly then you will not be require any kind of special food or the food supplement food supplement are taken by those children when or which feels that their diet is not proper or if they are not having their proper diet then only such kind of food supplement can be taken by the children's Now let us talk about some of the advantages of different kinds of food supplements. The supplements can contribute to improve your muscle strength, your endurance capabilities and overall performance of the body if you are taking certain kinds of food supplement for example protein shake for the bodybuilders. The next is food supplement also prevents a variety of diseases and health condition because they are manufactured in such a condition that they only contains those kind of dietary products only. or dietary supplements only the protein supplements available in the form of powder shakes or bar provide high quality protein to your diet and boost your protein intake so that the muscle can be gained very easily when you are taking such kind of protein powder shakes or bars so as advantages has been completed let us move to the disadvantages of various food supplements and there are if you are taking vitamin a which is toxic for example it can cause liver damage can blur your vision can give you headache bone pain and swelling drowsiness and nausea so taking vitamin a is under the supervision of a qualified doctor the second one is the supplement can also interact if you are taking some different kinds of medications or the medicines and can cause some unwanted side effects and decrease the efficiency of that medicine so the last point is the fat soluble vitamin if you are taking continuously or if you are taking more than what you need the vitamins or the fat soluble vitamins it can get accumulated in your fat tissues if you take it continuously or if you are taking it on a regular basis so now let us talk about some of the precautions which has to be taken for the food supplement you are taking so first thing is for optimal benefits first consult your doctor about the right dietary supplement which you can take and find out more about the supplement ingredient before you purchase the product so with, this is the first precaution now let us move to the second point which is avoid dietary supplement with mega doses which means mega doses are the doses which exceeds the recommended dietary intake such as vitamin a and vitamin d and iron are some of the dietary supplements which has to be removed if they are in mega doses 
नेक्स्ट ऑल दो मेगा डोजेस कैन बी बेनिफिशरी फॉर द ट्रीटमेंट ऑफ सर्टन हेल्थ कंडीशन बट दे कैन ऑल्सो कॉज टॉक्सिसिटी सिम्टम्स और दे कैन ऑल्सो टॉक्सिक योर बॉडी नेक्स्ट फाइनली स्टॉप स्टॉप टेकिंग एनी काइंड ऑफ सप्लीमेंट्स इफ यू आर एक्सपीरियंस एनी अनप्लीजेंट साइड इफेक्ट and never combine different kinds of supplement with medications or other supplement without your doctor's recommendations do not pay, pay heed to the word of salesmen or advertisement which claims that these supplements will improve child's brain there is nothing like this in all over this world next is first first of all ensure that there is a lack of essential nutrients in a child need to take food supplement or not so get assured about it the last is i hope you might have understood these topics very well if not i urge all of you to again repeat the video and watch it again you can also note this topic down as your notes so that you don't have to refer the books we at learn it are working hard to bring you all the easy and simple learning materials which can enhance your learning and listening capabilities If you are finding hard to understand any of the topic or want to know something in detail you can comment your questions down below in the comment section If you like our work please give it a thumbs up and if you want to get updated of our new videos do subscribe and hit the notification bell icon so that you don't miss any updates from the channel For more of such kind of updates stay tuned to the channel stay healthy stay safe and fit bye bye